Hey everyone, welcome back to Luxury with Calvin. I'm Calvin. Duh! Um, today, we are talking about our super exciting product. We're going to talk about the new Laura Mercier uh, Translucent Loose Setting Powder Ultra Blur. First of all, this packaging is, um, is so pretty, right? You got, like, the logo. And I love how, like, they bold it where it says Ultra Blur. So, like, you can really, like, tell... Because there's so many, like, translucent powder from Laura Mercier. So this one I love. And I love how, like, it's really, um, like a creamy beige. So pretty. So freaking pretty. Um, so, comes in this box. You open it up. And this is what it looks like. Super gorgeous. Look at that. I love it. I love the packaging. Um, so we're going to demo this today. Um, I will say I just got this in. So it's currently 8.53. So I won't be able to do a wear test. But on my next video, I'll definitely um, have another video coming up after this. And I'll definitely do a wear test along with this. But I think today I'm going to do a comparison video along with uh, the Makeup Forever powder. So I'm not going to do a comparison video against the original translucent powder just because... I know about a lot of beauty gurus going to do it, um, but I personally never loved the original powder because I have really dry skin, and this powder was just, um, was a little bit too thick or not as smoothing for me, um, so I don't prefer the original, but however, I love the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Setting Powder. I use Banana. This is one of, like, the smoothest powders that I've used, so we'll do a, a comparison between the two. So, let's get started. Okay, so my foundation is on. I got, I put Givenchy all over the skin. Uh, Prism, Libre, Prism Libre Matte Foundation all over the skin. Uh, I did a little bit of Dior, what is this called? Backstage Flash Perfector Concealer 3W under the eyes. Um, my skin is looking snatched. Look at this. Look at how smooth my skin looks. This is before powder, just, just so you know. By the way, I just want to do a quick shout out to this amazing product that I've been using for like two to three months now. It's from Coco Kine Ceramide Barrier Serum. I want you to, I want you guys to see this product. This product has saved my skin. If you um, have really dry skin, really sensitive skin, really irritated skin, reactive skin, you're always getting allergic reactions and your skin is dry and irritated, you have to try this. I have been using this. This is gonna turn into a review, but I just wanted to say that this product is amazing. I've been using this two to three months every morning and night as like my moisturizer and serum. This product is amazing. Like it just makes my skin so calm and soothed and hydrated. Like amazing. And you can find it at Target. I think it's like 20 bucks or 30 bucks. It's so good. So. Just want to give a shout out. That's why my skin looks so smooth because I have literally been using it for like the past couple of months. Plus, of course, the foundation and the concealer. But let's go ahead and try the new Laura Mercier powder, which I'm so excited. Ah, I'm so excited. A little bit of this powder. Oh, it comes out quick. Let me actually feel it first. Ooh, this powder is smooth. Oh yeah, it's like really silky, really smooth. Let's grab a brush. Um, oh, and by the way, I, have, I also have a Benefit Gimme Brow as my brow gel. This would be like my go-to face makeup routine if I'm gonna go out for like dinner with friends. Now, Laura Mercier recommends to use a face puff bomb, but I really just prefer a brush just because I like I like a lighter application and the brush is just easier for me. Um, so let's just oh powder everywhere. Let's go ahead and dust it on. Oh god dang it. I just remember something. <laughs> I just remember I wanted to show you guys the Makeup Forever on one side. But you know what? It's fine. I'll do that on my forehead. See, that's what happens when you get too excited about a product review and you forget about everything else. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look at that. Wow, this powder is smooth. 
I'm just going with a little bit more just to, I like, um, I like how this is looking. It sets the makeup. Wow, look at that. Look at that. I'm just gonna do. Look at that. That is extremely smooth. Wow. It's like pore blurring, texture blurring. Oh, yeah, this is nice. Okay, let's actually, for fun, um, let's do the forehead with the Makeup Forever in Banana. Now, one great thing about the Makeup Forever is that the Makeup Forever has, like, this the, this little sifter thingy, so it closes the powder, so it doesn't get all messy. That's one thing I love about the Makeup Forever. The Makeup Forever, I'm just going to use a little bit, just because it's for the forehead. I, I meant to do it on what, half and half. One side for one side would make a forever, one side with Laura, but you know, we forget. Alright, so on the forehead, I'm using the Makeup Forever in Banana. Oh, actually. Oh wow, this new Laura powder is amazing. It's more smoothing than the Makeup Forever. Here, I don't know if you guys can see. So I have my both of my cheeks. Both cheeks have um, Laura Mercier on it. And the forehead has Makeup Forever. Um, interestingly, the, for the Makeup Forever side, actually, the forehead, it's nice. But when I compare that to my cheeks, my cheeks are way smoother. Hmm. Okay, well, let's go ahead and try bronzer on top. I'm just going to go in with my Jaclyn Hill Vitamin D Bronzer, which I love this formula. It's freaking amazing. Every time I use this bronzer, it literally smells like pumpkin spice latte or chai or chai chai latte. That's literally what it smells like. It smells so good. I finally got this color in from Jaclyn Cosmetics. Right here you guys can see stuff on my lashes look at that I don't know if you can tell I don't know if you'll be able to see a difference from my cheeks with the forehead so forehead is Makeup Forever Ultra HD powder in banana and then the cheeks are Laura Mercier new ultra blur translucent loose setting powder oh by the way just quickly I wanted to to say the claims uh, this iconic translucent loose setting powder, now top free with ultra blurring power. This, tr translucent, this truly translucent powder sets makeup for 16 hours of weightless wear with matte self focus finish. Infused with ultra blurring ingredients like amino acid and silica powder blend, Laura's new formula instantly blurs away the look of pores, fine lines, and imperfections with total shine control and zero photo flashback. Um, what prompted me to get this initially was because of that it's talc free, which is just amazing, right? Talc, talc, you know, is generally more heavy, a little bit more thicker. So because it's talc free and it has silica, it's going to be more blurring, you know. Think silica, think of like silicone, you know, anytime you use like a silicone primer, it's like that silky smoothing, smoothing finish. So just wanted to grab a mirror and really look. Wow, my skin... <laughs> My skin is freaking poreless. Poreless, flawless. It's actually even smoother than the Makeup Forever. You can tell that the Makeup Forever is like a little bit on the... I guess when you compare the new Laura powder to the new Makeup Forever powder, the, the Makeup Forever powder looks more thicker. You can see it. It's kind of like thicker than the Laura powder. The Laura powder is just more smoother and finer and just smooth. It looks amazing. So to conclude, I'm not going to do a word test in this video, but I'll probably do a word test in the next video. Um, I have to say I'm thoroughly impressed. I'm going to keep using this powder and I'll definitely report back to you guys. Uh, I have the new Hourglass Foundation that should be coming in the mail. It was supposed to arrive today, but maybe tomorrow. Um, so I'll definitely do a wear test with that and the new loose powder, but I definitely upon first base impressions It's amazing. It's so smooth My skin looks flawless 
it's I mean I literally have no words this is li this I would say is probably gonna be their new bestseller because it's literally amazing I, I I'm just gonna keep it real I wouldn't be surprised if the old formula gets discontinued because this new formula is bomb I haven't worn it yet in terms of wear test but in terms of first impressions it's flawless it's smooth it's thin it's light it's smoothing like texture smoothing everything oh I love it so that is it for today um, definitely recommend for you to go and go and get it just go if you can I think I, I believe it's actually available in stores now so definitely go pick up this powder give it a try it is amazing like in my personal opinion 10 times more amazing than the original formula even better than the makeup forever powders so that just says a lot that just tells me that this powder is going to be my new favorite so give it a try um stay tuned for my new video of the new hourglass uh soft focus foundation that's coming right up so i will catch you guys in the next video bye